Okay, I'm gonna attempt to flip through sitting down, just kind of relaxing with my dog. <laughs> This is a mini Finsbury, and I got this a couple years ago because I saw a YouTuber named Ellie who has a shop called Sort Stuff Out post a mini Malden and she had filled it up. I was like, uh, that is so cute. And yeah, she influenced me again because she recently got a new mini Malden and made a bunch of inserts and provided them for free on her website. So I sure did download all of them and put together my mini Finsbury. So let me just do a little walkthrough. So uh, my driver's license and my main card, and then I put this little Coffee Monsters um, decal, just paper clipped it. Um, I punched this little journaling card from the planner spot, and I put some sticky notes in the back. This is an inbox section. Now, I went ahead and make these little dividers out of vellum, and I laminated them, and y'all, I'm not going to zoom in because they are janky when you get them up close. <laughs> So inbox, I'm, I'm not really an inbox user, but it was part of the freebie, so I got it. And I think I'm just going to use it for order tracking, like when it ships and when I receive it. I think that's how I'm going to use it. So inbox, she does a monthly, which I'm going to show you a blank one because I already have some of this stuff filled out. Um, let's see. Okay, so I'm going to show you. So basically she does a mini month up here and then like a dates and events and then monthly tasks and notes and reminders. And I have the whole year in here because it's tiny and look, look how cute that is. Yep. And then weekly section. So I took this from a pocket file effects and I trimmed it down and made it a mini. <laughs> I even like cut the edge here and rounded it cause I'm extra. But yeah, so I will snap that in when I'm actually using the week. So she did a fold out week. So basically it starts here where you have this week, what's important, reminders, and then the inside is like this little week at a glance, and then essential tasks and ideal tasks, so you can have it split up like priorities and then it'd be good if we got it done. And then the back is goals and a habit tracker. Now. The key here is the inside, so it's a fold out. So you basically get a full week like this. And y'all, it's a lot of space. These boxes are bigger than my personal. Like they're bigger than, they're a bigger space than, this looks ginormous next to it, by the way. <laughs> so uh, this is amazing, I love it. I've already started using it, but I had a lot of um, personal information already kind of built in there, so I took it out just so I could show you a blank one. And then dailies, y'all, look at these dailies. Look how cute these are. So I've been putting the date up here and the weather, like the day, the date, the weather, any main events, of course, what I need to get done. I've actually been putting my full food plan in here and then just any notes or any reminders or anything cute down there. Um, reading, okay, this is the one thing I made myself. I'm gonna show you what she did. So she did a reading log where you can track your reading this way, which is super cute. I haven't filled anything out yet because I haven't transferred what I've already read in here. I kind of want to have it from the beginning of the year through now, and I haven't done it yet. But I went ahead, I like to track my reading. In my personal planner, I have a larger size of this, but I went ahead and made a mini calendar like this, and it kind of flows to the bottom, where I'll, basically what I do is I print an abbreviation, the book, the full book title, and then I just put the abbreviation on the days that I read it. But I also made like a little mini to-do list because I do do like a monthly newsletter with some like social media graphics and stuff like that. And then like a little stats chart. <laughs> yep. So I made a little mini one of that. I just did May and June, so I thought I'd try it out. And then, um, of course, her reading log. And then I took Peanuts Planner Co's the list for pocket and I reduced it to I think it was like 82% it's slightly smaller but it works and basically what I did there was y'all I, I have a bunch of cozy mystery series that when I'm out and about like at used bookstores and I see them I just want to be able to see wait do I have that one or not so I basically put them all on here like a little checklist and so I figured since I'm going to try and use this as my wallet it'd be nice to have them in here and then just notes. So this is also part of um, Ellie's freebies. This freebie is Peanuts Planner Co. 
this is Ellie and so I just put a bunch in there and then same thing with this this was a pocket page lifter and I trimmed it down and I put it in here so I could because these rings y'all are so tiny that you need the page lifter like you need it and then in the back I just have some cash like I think like five dollars there <laughs> but then I have extra of these peanuts planner co pocket um, freebies like size down and then I have blank weeks from Ellie so I'm going to tag um, like everything like the video from Ellie in her shop and basically sort stuff out that's her shop name and if I'm saying that wrong I'm sorry I will correct it in the description but yeah I'm gonna put it all down there so that way you guys can see but yes you know I'm so excited oh and I only have stamps in here right now stamps so cash stamps planner stuff you know cards wallet and it, look at how stinking cute this is I freaking love it so thank you Ellie for the freebies thank you for the inspiration I'm thrilled okay bye